guys. Hope you liked our outfits in the last video because we're doing another one today in the same outfits. And then this one was actually originally a top five Wednesday that I missed getting to. So we're doing top five characters we'd like to drown. The first one's going to be one that we would both like to drown. And then we each have two of our own. And I guess we'll explain to you why we want to drown them and try not to go into too much spoilers about the books. And yeah, so let's get started. The first one both of us would like to drown is Dolores Umbridge from the Harry Potter books. Who doesn't want to drown her, though? Exactly. Like, I feel like that's enough <laughs> of a statement. Like, <laughs> Am she, I allowed to say that? I don't care what you say. <laughs> she literally carved, I shall not tell lies, into Harry's fucking arm for the next two books. He, I mean, for the rest of his life, he has that carved in his arm because she didn't like the truth he was telling. He posed like a pure blood and likes... I don't remember the exact details because I haven't read the seventh book in a long time, but she, like, posed as, like, a pure blood, like, just to, like, stay out of trouble and, like, stole someone's credentials for that. So I'm going to let Tiff do her character, then I'm going to do a character, and then we'll go from there. Um, I don't have these ranked in any particular order, but, like, the first one I thought of was, uh, what was his name? Agent Truman from the Taking series, Ben Kimberly, uh, Dirty, just because, like, he has no redeeming qualities at all. Like, usually for, like, bad guys in books, I can find something to where I'm like, they're just human and they're making mistakes. No, this guy was just an asshole throughout the entire book series. And then the second one was from, like, a random book series I found for sale on my nook called uh, the Stung series, which was Aaron slash Eris, who, like, I think they were, like, I want to drown them because, like, they seemed like they had, like, the redeeming qualities at first, and then you find out in the end they're just a shitty person. It's, I don't do well with, like, terrible people. The first character I would like to drown would be Triss from Divergent by Veronica Ross because she just annoyed me. Like, I was rooting for her to die. Like, throughout all the books, she annoyed me. She was, like, a goody-goody, and she just... I couldn't stand her. Like, I hated her as a character. The only reason I continued to read those books was because of Four. And then even in the last book, Four started to bug me. So, like, I don't know why I continued reading through the last book when I really didn't like it that much. <laughs> And the other character I would like to drown, hold their head underwater, and watch the last breath leave would be Max from the Max and Ride books. Because I like Max. <laughs> the more they progressed, the more whiny she got. And given the series should have ended after book three, but it continued on for, I think, another, like, four or five at least. One, two, three, four, five, six books that shouldn't have been there. Didn't he make another new one, too, like, I, recently? I just got the other. That's counting that one. But, yeah, so they shouldn't even be there, and she just gets more and more whiny, and it's like, oh, I want to be with Fang, but I love Dylan. Dylan, Dylan, Dylan. Shut up. Just shut up, Max. I am the leader, not you. I am the leader. I am in control, and I was just like, shut up, Max. So I would enjoy drowning her quite a bit. But, yeah, guys, that's the top five characters we'd like to drown. Top five Wednesday tag thing that we just Hashtag decided to pop five Friday. I don't think I'm posting this today, but thanks for watching, top guys. Five day. Top five. Bye.